Hey guys, I'm in my backyard right now. It is beautiful out here. I needed to be uh, in my backyard and just take a breather. Um, I've been crying all day. Most of you know we got the news, Joshua. Um, a couple of weeks ago, he rang the bell. Last chemo, we were excited. They saw that the cancer was um, was gone, and then it um, they passed can today, and they said it came back. It's very small. The lymphoma still um, came back, but um, it's small. Um, but it's, it's aggressive. They said. We're going to trust the Lord during this time. It's not easy, you know, as a mom. Any mom that uh, has their child battling cancer, cancer's cancer. It's not, it's just not easy for any parent, you know, to see their child go through it, you know. Um, so, yeah. And it just hurts me more because I heard my son crying. It's the worst news. And um, they come, they didn't have sympathy. They don't know what to do. Either they say, well, maybe go another round of chemo or radiation. There's another treatment they could do is T cell. And um, yeah, so it's another treatment has to do with his cells, something like that. And it's very expensive. This says about like a million dollars. It's stressful because right now Joshua has no insurance and we're trying where we can to help him out. And um, he was working, but can't because of the when he was getting chemo, it was, it was extremely aggressive. So, you know, he was getting sick. And, um, yeah, so we're just trying to figure stuff out, you know. Gotta, you know, we're remaining faith. But um, it's just sad because medical, they said to him that the cost is going to be a million dollars and that he can't afford it. So for that treatment, so that's not gonna be an option for him. And I don't think that's right. Because if it's a cancer center, and you know these patients need treatment, they need help, why aren't you giving the best care? Even if it costs a million dollars. So that's to show me that medical, it's all about money. And it's always been that way, but now it's becoming clearer and clearer, even now, more than anything. And it's an infusion that it costs a million dollars and they say he can't afford it. That's crazy that you will say something to him. Like he feels like he has no hope. Like, it's, it's just, it blows, just blows my mind. Blows my mind. And this is a cancer center and it's Moffitt. Moffitt, and they said this to him, Moffitt, that's supposed to help. So I'm not bashing anyone. I just, it's just the way I feel. And I just feel like, you know, people need help. And, um, yeah, I have no words, no words.